Hi and welcome. In this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make your spreadsheets run faster if you have uh, a very very large amount of formulas or links to other workbooks. And if you'd like to download this workbook go to teachexcel.com search for this video tutorial and you can get the workbook there. So what I'm talking about is um, if you have say a hundred thousand formulas that are relatively basic in a particular spreadsheet or if you have a hundred thousand links in a particular spreadsheet that are relatively basic or if say you only have five thousand formulas but they are very sophisticated array formulas in any one of those circumstances you could have a workbook that every time it recalculates the formulas takes a really long time to do so so much so that it uh, impacts your productivity even significantly it could happen or it could be and uh, Oftentimes, if you have that many formulas, you don't need them all to update every time you do something. So, for instance, I have two tabs here. These are all just random numbers, randomly generated, and this workbook links to them. So, every time I say type anything in a cell and hit enter, it's going to recalculate all of that. Um, most of the time in a business environment, however, unless you're running simulations, these are not going to be random numbers. They're going to be static numbers that are on occasion updated. As a result, you don't need them to all change every time you enter something into a cell. So picture every time you enter something, you have to wait five minutes to be able to enter something else because the workbook is processing. So the way to fix that is to turn automatic calculation of formulas off. How you do that, it's very simple. Go to the formula tab, go to the calculation box, calculation options, and where it says automatic, click manual or select manual. And now, every time I try to enter something or I enter something into a cell, you'll notice that the formulas do not update. So, if it took five minutes to update all the formulas before, now it just does it automatically because the formulas don't update. But it is very important to note that, uh, that all formulas or that um, no formula on your worksheet or in that workbook is going to update. So even though you want only, um, or you just want to speed up calculation in your workbook, you could have a few formulas that you always want to update. But you can't just say, only update these few formulas, but don't update the other million formulas. The only way you can do that was with a macro, and I will show you how to do that in one of the VBA tutorials. Now, once you've turned off the automatic calculation of the formulas, there are two ways you can recalculate everything. One, select Calculate Sheet. And as the little drop-down will tell you, it says Calculate the Current Sheet Now. That will update the formulas. The reason you saw nothing change here is because all of the formulas that make these numbers change, the RAND formulas, are on this tab. So if I click Calculate Sheet here, you'll see the numbers update. The other option is Calculate Now. Now be careful before you click this. It doesn't mean just calculate what you're looking at. It says Calculate the entire workbook. So this calculates every worksheet in the workbook. Now one last thing, when we went to, cal we went to calculation options, we selected manual, but this is not, these are not all the options that you can select for this. And oftentimes when you click manual, you think, okay, well it's never going to update now unless I tell it to, unless I click calculate now or calculate sheet. But that's incorrect. The, um, to get the, all of the options, you need to go to the office button, click Excel options, go to the formula tab, and here, calculation options. This is where you can select automatic, automatic except for data tables or manual. But see, recalculate workbook before saving. This is automatically checked by default if you changed the settings via the ribbon. And if your workbook takes five minutes to update its formulas or longer, you're probably not going to want to wait for that when you're saving. So uncheck recalculate workbook before saving. And now the workbook completely updates 
only manually. So it's only going to update when you tell it to. The one thing I forgot to mention, or I will mention, you can update sheets or the workbook via the keyboard shortcut F9. So every time you click F9 on the keyboard or hit that button, it will update. So that's how you turn off automatic formula updating in Excel and you can speed up massive workbooks. Uh, if you want to turn it back on to how it used to be, go to the formulas tab, calculation options, and select automatic. And then you're back to normal. So every time you enter something, spreadsheet updates. So that's it for this tip, and if you'd like to download the workbook, go to teachexcel.com, search for the video tutorial, and download it there.